My lord, when to next? <laughs> well, considering everyone else said they would be in white run, how about that? Alright, sounds good. Come on, I know a shortcut, uh, provided you're alright with a few spriggans along the way. What the? Is that a. Yeah. Eyes open. We don't know who or what killed it. Wait. What's wrong? This is Grima. This is my horse. Uh, oh dear. Watch my back. Oh, watching. Who did this? What's wrong? Uh, uh, Ingrath, talk to me. What's going on? What's wrong? Get away from me. What? No, I'm... I want to help you. What was that? Okay. Abai Kavan, Ingrath. to do this to you, but...
There you are. <laughs> now I see why most of the soldiers from Riften were scared of you. Hey, God, boy. I speak enough Aeliodin to understand you, dear. I'm not leaving no matter what language you tell me to get lost in. Arden, please. She'll kill you. Who? Hegatha. They... No, 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 no. Who's... Ingrath, please tell me what's going on. Please. Calm down. Talk to me. Artas Betoth. Watereth. Why are you... Just... Let me breathe. Oh, sorry. Take your time. Artas Betoth. Watereth. Moramolag. Venaro. Sidan. Niraya. Virhan. Artas Betoth. Watereth. Moramolag. Venaro. Sidan. Niraya Virhan. You're right? I... I don't have much time. If she knew that was my horse, she knows too much. She who? Hegatha. The Inquisitor. Whoa, the... Thalmor sent an Inquisitor after you? Gods, I knew they wanted your hair, but I mean... Not that badly. They... I have a life sentence, Arden. This... This is the worst time to tell you any of this. I'm... I'm so sorry. What did you do? Kill the bastard that took out your mother, or...? I'm afraid... of her... of telling you anything, really. I don't want to put you through this again, but... I don't want to lie to you, either. Again? What do you... Okay, several questions. Most of them boil down to what are you hiding and or what in oblivion was that just now? That was still me. Mostly. Normally I can control it a lot better than that. Let out just a shred of that form to give me strength and speed, but... All of your questions are related. The answers are, anyway. I was... I was waiting until we were all safe and settled and the war was over before I tried to tell you about any of this. I should have... I ran out of time. You're pushing me away again. I have to, this time. Hegatha is... relentless. She'll kill you by association. Arden. I'm sorry, I'm... I'm so sorry. I'm a deserter. Ah, uh, What? The Thalmor killed my mother and stepfather after they recruited me by force to be in the Aldmeri Scout Corps in Woodhearth. That's... That's what they started out saying, anyway. The reason they picked me over any other random kid with a good eye is because my mother... My name is Ingrath Rulani. Or was. I couldn't bear hearing her name when I left, so I... I took Stormsong instead. It was my stepfather's name. What does that even... What are you saying? Rulani, you studied all of the women in my family going back generations attended a shrine to her scene built by our ancestors and briefly occupied by doesn't matter Rulani's fall all of the women I'm the end of that line and the Thalmor wanted to make sure of that that I was under their control and couldn't Go rogue, I guess. Rulaniel, that's... That's an alien clan. From Vilverin. Yes. Your ancestors were refugees. Yes. All of the women... You're an alien? 
More Bosmer than Heartlander by a long shot at this point, but technically, yes. It was really only a matter of time until someone had no daughters. And here I am. Which is why I can turn into that thing. Why I grew up praying to her scene and not Ifrae. Why the Thalmor decided I'd make a good weapon. <sighs> I... <laughs> All this time and you... Why keep that a secret? Who would ever believe me? <laughs> it's all so tied up in so much other shit I have a hard time even thinking about it. Ingrath Rulani. Once upon a time. And what's that name on the paper then? Kariel? Don't say that name. I'm not. I'm... I... I never want to hear it again. What does it mean? Besides Fetcher, obviously. Is that what... <laughs> Fuckers. Ingrath? It's the name they gave me when they... When they broke me. And what does that mean? Look, I never wanted to tell you this because I knew about Ancano. I know you loved him. I know he broke your heart open and left you bleeding. Didn't he ever tell you what the Thalmor do to people? To new recruits? Did Ancano ever tell you how they break you open and tear out everything that makes you you so they can replace it with what they think you should be? No. He... Didn't tell me anything. I didn't think he... He knew. If he was anything like you say he was, a brilliant mage, all that... They took him in when he was barely more than a boy and broke him the same way they broke me. That he survived means he either gave in or was a very good actor, and considering where he ended up, I'm inclined to believe the former. Ingrath, you asked, Arden. You've asked over and over again, and I'm finally telling you. And I wish I didn't have to do it right now, in this context, but right at the moment, I don't care how you felt about him, because on some level, he and I are the same. We were both Thalmor. And I will never be able to escape it. No, wait. Don't touch me. Then don't run! You're stronger than this, I know you are! No, Arden, I'm not. You have no idea what it's like in one of those chairs. You have no idea the things they do to people. Then tell me! Quill Navoy. You want to know who I am, Arden? Who else, rather? <laughs> I'm a deserter. I'm a coward. I'm a scout. I'm an assassin. That's how I lost my eye. I crossed the damn Niven to get away from the Thalmor and Leia when and got tangled up with the wrong Argonian. He took my eye. I took his place. I'm... I'm the listener of the damn Dark Brotherhood. I'm the pretender. I'm the one. All these pretentious death cult dipshits who think they know the one true way these things should work are trying to find. I kill people because a voice in my head who may or may not be Mafala asks me to. I pray to Hercene and he answers. I heard Kine wailing about dragons and shore and all the souls that got lost in Sovngarde when Alduin was there. I was a bandit. <laughs> That's probably the least awful thing I've done with my life. I am not a good person, Arden. You. I'm not done. I deserted by killing my training officer. I split his head open with an axe and hid in the Reaper's March for a year. The symbol on that paper was my symbol. That name was my name. Hegatha was my Inquisitor. She's the one who got assigned to keep me in line and turn me into a... She knows me, Arden. She knows how I work. She knows what scares me. She is the only one who could have sent that no because she is the only one left alive who knew me as both Ingrath Rulani and... <laughs> and I will never be Ingrath Rulani again. That boy, that kid, was tortured to death, chained to a chair in a Thalmor dungeon in Woodhearth. 
It's a wonder I retained enough of a shred of who I was to get out of there, but that... Those memories will never leave me. I will never escape. Not really. How long were you planning on keeping me in the dark about all of this? I... I don't know. As long as I could, if I'm gonna be honest. I'm... I'm a coward. I'm not... Whatever you think I am, I'm not this troubled mercenary with a heart of gold. I'm... I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt you. Well, you did! What the bloody... Okay, fine, sure, we can... Gods! So an Inquisitor is after you. Because you're a deserter, because you're a shapeshifter, because you're a bloody alien, which is why you worship her scene. Oh, right, and you're the, you know, like we needed the actual physical Dark Brotherhood on top of this whole mess. Yes. You know, of all the conversations I remember having with Onkano, the one that won't leave me no matter how hard I try to forget it, is the one we had when they recalled him back to Alinor. And you know what he said to me? He also said he didn't want to hurt me. He said he wasn't done with me yet. He said he wouldn't be the same person the next time he saw me, and he was right. He told me if he didn't go back, they'd send an Inquisitor after him who would likely kill me by association, and now, here, I find myself in the exact same position with an actual Inquisitor this time. <laughs> Mara, you absolutely heartless bitch, give me a break. I'm not... I can't do this again. I'm not willing to hold on to that hope that if I let you go, I won't see you come back, is it? I guess the monster they wanted you to be. I'm not... What in all bloody oblivion are we going to do? I'm... I, you have no idea how... Betrayed you feel? Yes, I do. Try me. No, I... Look, that's... I, I can't even think right now, there's no time to think, and now I... I want to solve this. This is a problem I don't know how to solve, and... Arden, I have to leave. Before she finds us, kills you while I watch, and brings me back to... wherever they take me. Oh, Ingrath, no, that's not what... Look after they test for me. Ingrath, no, wait, I... you, 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 can't, you can't just... Don't follow me. <laughs> like you'd even be able to catch up. Oh no, I, I, I can't do this again. Wrath. Hello, Arden. What happened? The fuck in wrath is gone. Gone? What do you mean, he's gone? I mean, a Thalmor Inquisitor killed his horse, left him a note with his dead name on it, and scared us both so badly he... Um, I'm not sure what specifically to call it, but to say it wasn't pretty would be a severe understatement. Oh no. Not here. Come with me. This is new. This is what I've been doing while you all were off fighting wars and whatnot. Now tell me what happened besides the horse thing. I got angry and scared. 
He told me everything, pretty much. Oh. Everything, everything? I might regret saying this, but yes. The Thalmor, the Dark Brotherhood, the bandit thing? Uh, no, he didn't mention... Wait, yes he did, but it kind of got lost in the mess. I... I got angry! Not a, I never want to see you again kind of angry, but a, I want to solve this problem, I'm confused, I can't think, and... I don't know, Dom, I, I don't even know anything anymore. I, I know everything, and now I feel like I never really knew him at all. Did you hurt him? Not physically. I probably said some things I'll regret later. I... I can't... Th I can't think! I'm... I'm... He kept me in the dark about all of that and now... Now he's just... He's... Gone and... I don't know where and I don't know how to get him back. Easy, Arden. We have time. When Ingrath hides, nobody can find him who doesn't know how to track by scent. He'll be safe for the time being. Unless he panics, of course. That's what I'm afraid of. I... I pulled a Kinawa. I got angry because I'm afraid. And I shouldn't have gotten angry. I... I can't do this again, but I didn't mean... I didn't mean I wanted him to leave. I know you didn't. He... Mara, help me. I'm so sorry. We'll figure this out. Together. Well, you know who he is now. I suppose there's no use in holding back anymore. My normal methods for protecting people from... Well, interested but violent third parties don't exactly apply here, but I can still make it work. We'll also have to track him down, of course, so you can figure things out with him. We... Yes, I'm... Gods, I'm an idiot. A reckless, thoughtless idiot. You are many things, dear boy, but an idiot is not usually one of them. Which is good, because I think between the two of us we'll be able to outwit the Thalmor, if not overpower them. Assuming you get your head back on straight. I <laughs> can't do anything straight. Humor me. Not the response I was expecting, but yes, okay. Step one. Calm down. I'm trying. I'm saying this for my own sake as much as for you. I don't want to see him hurt any more than you do. He panics when he gets cornered. He... <laughs> he, he went full. Whatever that thing was. Big horned creepy thing. Did he hurt you? Only emotionally. And a lot. I... I think we both gave as good as we got, though, which I feel awful about, frankly. We can use that as long as we can keep you from paralyzing yourself with indecision or fear or... whatever it is you're feeling. Like a heartbroken moron right at the moment. I suppose we'll have to work with that. We both need to try not to get caught up in it. You care about him, too? More than I will ever admit. Which means we both have to distance ourselves from this so we can think like rational people. <laughs> Usually I'm good at that sort of thing. Step one. Calm down. Step two. Goals. What do we need to do? We need to find him, and we need to contend with an Inquisitor. From what I've heard, that's nigh impossible. We just have to be prepared for it, like any other monster. Just like how you dealt with Harkon. You'll need something that can stop... Her? Her. Hegatha, apparently. Oh dear. What? She's a member of the Dawn Guard, which means she not only has access to silvered weapons and armor, but also dogs. No, 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 shit, Dom, I thought we were supposed to be coming down, not... Easy. He knows how to evade dogs. He's had the best training in the world for avoiding detection. If anyone can stay safe, even in spite of everything stacked against him, he'll be that person. Especially with his guard up like this. It's the downside of splitting someone away from the pack, so to speak. 
Easier to take care of when they're finally found, but without a large number of recognizable people around, he'll be very hard to track. But they will track him! There are only so many places for a vampire to hide in Skyrim! How long before- Right at this moment? Even if we knew the answer to that question, it wouldn't serve any purpose. All we need to know is that we need to work fast. And to do that, we need to work smart and calm down. We won't do ourselves any favors by rushing around and making mistakes. Right. Damn it. Mordgood. She might be in danger if... Should we tell the others? Maybe. I don't think we should tell the Harbinger or Dragonborn. They'll likely just panic and get in the way. Or turn hostile when we mention he was a Thalmor. I'd rather leave that up to him. Mordgood. We might want to inform her that Hegatha is bad company if she doesn't know already. Zaytest might be able to help us. How? She has access to both the Thieves' Guild and the Dark Brotherhood. If he hides anywhere that they have eyes, she'll know about it. She's an assassin too. Oh, you didn't know. No, I'm the last bloody person to know anything about this man. Or anyone, apparently. Nobody tells me anything, or I haven't been paying attention, which is also possible. Easy, Arden. Your fangs are- I know! I'm- <laughs> I haven't been this angry in a very long time. Maybe ever. I feel like I know how the werewolves must feel now. It's hard to control, isn't it? Very. The other reason I'm worried is because Mordgood is one of the werewolves if- Gods forbid if she and Hagatha are actually working together. Oh, easy, Arden. Rein it in. I've met Mordgood. She has a good head on her shoulders. She knows better. You're right. Sorry. Arthas Beethoth. Know the beast. <laughs> Did Ingrath teach you that one? No, but I had kind of forgotten about it until he started reciting it. It's an old alien battle chant and a sound piece of advice. Okay, step one, calm down. Step two, figure out how to track him down without Hegatha in turn tracking us. And figure out how to deal with her if she does. Good, you're breathing again. <laughs> Not like I need to, but hard to talk otherwise. <sighs> we need to get Zaytest in the know. Yes, she's very smart. She's actually deceptively smart. And if she's actually an assassin and a thief, that will be very valuable, and it would explain a lot about her methods. And how she had enough money to buy a house without flinching. <laughs> she is a shrewd one. And she's seen how Ingrath works. She knows how he thinks. We need her help. Badly. Okay. We can't really figure out how to find him, or how to deal with a vampire-aware, possibly dog-brandishing Inquisitor, until we get her on board. I mean, you could probably go toe-to-toe -to -toe with her and live. If she doesn't get the jump on me, you mean? This is an Inquisitor we're talking about here. If she knew who he was, what his horse looked like, and where he'd likely be... She's had eyes on us more often than we thought. I don't expect I'll be able to get the upper hand. You're absolutely glorious when you're vengeful. I hadn't thought of it that way, but that's exactly what I'm feeling right now. <laughs> vengeful. Alright. Well, Zaytest is usually in Riften when she isn't out doing... odd jobs, shall we say. Killing people or stealing things? <laughs> don't be casting aspersions now, Lord Volgahar. Don? You're a genius. In what way? Hegatha isn't the only one with dogs, and we know better than to use them on him. If we can find her and take her out first, we can focus on finding him. <laughs> I'm very glad I made peace with the Dawn Guard now. If that's where she's been hiding this whole time, I might be able to pick up a scent. Or... Gamma will, rather. Assuming Ezron doesn't try to kill me on sight. I'd rather not get more good involved in this, but... No. I'd feel guilty bringing her in to fight an Inquisitor, even if she is a werewolf. Oh. Oh my. 
Okay. Here's my plan so far. We're going to find Zaytest first. Or I am. I don't know what you're going to do. I'm going to hold down the fort here. Or in the actual den, rather. In case he comes stumbling in at some point. I'm also going to put my little birds on watch. Right. Okay. Find Zaytest, get her in the loop, make a plan with her. At some point I'm going to have to head back to Castle Vogahar and take Gamma for a much needed walk. With any luck he can alert me to anyone trying to stab me in the back and he might be able to track down Ingrath once we're able to deal with Hegatha. I knew I liked you. You might consider going to get Garmer first. That way you can track down Zaytest quicker if she happens to be out on a job. Smart. I didn't think I liked you, but you may yet prove me wrong. <laughs> get Garmer, get Inigo, but not after we've filled in Zaytest. If she isn't at her house, by the way, look for Brynjolf. Big Nord, red hair, likes to play snake oil salesman, but he's actually the face for the Thieves' Guild. Sounds like he's from Falskar. Can't miss him. Alright, so if I hear Lobdeer, I'm in the right place. Good to know. Tell him you have a message for Delvin Mallory if it gets weird. If he gets really weird, tell him I sent you. There's a story behind that specific order of instructions. I want to know what it is, but we have much bigger fish to fry. Indeed we do. Be careful out there, Lord Volgahar. And remember how strong you are. Right. I will. Take off, wolves. Okay. Gone first. Then they test. Gone first, then they test. Riften is right there. Gone first. Then they test. Besides, it's the middle of the night and she's probably asleep. At least she will be if she's smart, which she is, so... I don't have time for wolves today. Is that High Hrothgar? Not me. I've rested. Wait. Helgen. Okay. I am going the right direction. Okay, that's the third. Uh, hello, bear. That's the third of the world. I think. Soxies. This is probably not a shortcut. Definitely not. Okay. for anything today. Spiders chief among them. So 
solitude. It'll be quicker going this way. I do wish this wouldn't happen at inopportune moments. I know they can see me, I just don't want to burn them. There we go. I gone the wrong way again? Don't believe so. Nope. There are still guards here. Great. This is the reason that he probably won't come back to Castle Fokaha. Right. Okay. Safe and sound, and that's still beyond my skills. Oh well. We just have one wonky tower, that's fine. Don't get distracted by the tower or the dust or there's gum. Hey, hey, pop, come with me. Uh, don't do that, please. Ah, uh, right. Follow me. Come on, gum. All right. Now, if I remember correctly, I have a thing for you. 
Did I actually finish it? I think so. Okay. Now then. You just hold still, okay? Well, that worked. Uh... Well, I was... Yeah, 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 yeah. Are you... Well, I was hoping for a... Grayish... Something less conspicuous. You still do kind of look like a death hound, but at least you're a cuddly death hound now. I can deal with that. All right. Are you going to be a good boy? Probably be all right. Okay. It's the middle of the day. Zotest is probably awake. All right. No, no chasing the cats. All right. We're going to Solitude, we're going to take a wagon, we're going to go down to Riften. You don't know what any of those places are. <sighs> right. You know... I can't actually believe that worked. Master of Enchantment, indeed. Uh, Where's... Master Morethi? Probably doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, Kusith. You actually look smaller now. Interesting. Side effects. Nobody's awake. Of course, because it's the middle- it's- it's morning. I'm... Duh. So much for table manners. That's fine. Bigger fish to fry. Come on, Gamma.